Welcome to the program, please, everybody. Sean Roberts. How are you, man? Uh, I'm doing great. Good to be here. Thanks yeah. for having me. Nice to see you. You're look at you. You're like a. You look like Marky Mark in his heyday. Like you're you're fit, bro. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Tell Kelvin Klein. I'm I'm waiting. <laughs> yeah. You're you're waiting for the big he do, doesn't he? Look at this guy. A stud. A stud. <laughs> if I've ever seen one, I'd say. Yeah. He's 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 a stud. How how long have you been acting for, Sean? Uh, we're going on 20 years, 20 plus years, yeah. 20? Dude, yeah. you look like no no older than 25 years old. How old are you? That's awfully sweet of you. Uh, I'm into my 30s. Are you in your th- Now, is yeah. that, does that matter for, as an actor, or is that, does that open up your roles, in fact? No, it's um, actually, all in all, it's working out rather well, both in uh, professional and uh, personal life. Um, everybody likes a little maturity, so it's good. I, I moisturize, I drink lots of water, stay out of the sun. But, uh, you know, it's, it's, I was always told that the best role is coming in your 30s, so I'm, I'm waiting for it. Hey, were you born in Stratford? I grew up in Stratford. You grew yeah. up in Stratford. Yeah. So, and everyone knows Stratford is the home of Justin Bieber. Absolutely. So now I have to ask: Do are, do you have people who are? So I know he's a little bit younger than you, a decade younger than you. But are there are there people who you know who know Bieber? Is this the sort of Bieber connection? Uh, there's definitely you know the uh, seven degrees of separation, uh, if you will. Um, it's it's a small town, right? So uh, our population's like thirty two thousand is is what it's listed at. So there's definitely stories of oh yeah, I used to uh, and I know him from and whatever. But uh, uh, me personally, I have no attachment or anything to him, so I don't know. It. How many auditions will you go to in a week, say? Well, now that I'm on in my years, um, very little. Okay, um, I might have one tape to make for and and. I've recently discussed this with my team that, um, Mm. you know, we are trying to be specific and working at a a certain value, a certain quality. Um, So that starts to limit your your opportunities. Um, But, uh, yeah, back in the heyday, um, when I actually lived in Stratford, I would travel back in and out of the city for probably four auditions a week. So, yeah, it used to be really busy, but... Well, slow down. Yeah, you got to slow down. But I, interesting. So you put a worth to what you think your value is now. You have a list of credits, anything from uh, the girl he met online to tomorrow people to I do, I do, I do, which is a recent one. Uh, you're filming now 40 Below and Falling. Is that right? Uh, we finished that up in January in Edmonton. Yeah. Good stuff. Uh, somebody else is another movie, right? Uh, that's uh, rumored. So Not that, allowed talking there's, about. Okay, uh, there's stuff in the works, you know. And whether it was Flashpoint the day, but now it's like, okay, I've done all this. I'm a recognizable face. I'm a great actor. Uh, let's instead of me auditioning, you kind of you have to sort of want me, right? Is that is that sort of the struggle? That's uh, that's the point where we're at, trying to separate us from uh, the rest of the crowd and um, elevate it to a different game. When you know. You put 20 years in working anything else, you hope that eventually you start moving up in the ranks. And um, that's sort of where we're trying to uh, shoot for that, you know, we're not just like everybody else. And uh, you're getting uh, a better product when you by Sean Roberts. So. I, and I think that's, oh. you know, it's weird. Isn't it uncomfortable talking about yourself as a brand? And, you know, I, I've always hated that. But it's, it's you seem not to mind, actually, which is cool. <laughs> uh, maybe I got to get more of that mentality. Then again, I don't look like I just posed in a Calvin Klein underwear uh, poster. Uh, man, is this ki- uh, kid good looking. Uh, as Sean Roberts is here. It, 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 I, I like to hear that, though, because you have to have some sort of uh, integrity for who you are and for what you know you can bring to a project. That's the it. I mean, you're, you're constantly dealing with um, no's and, well, there's this, there's that, and everything else that we don't like about you that's not right. So eventually you have to say, you know what? This is great. This is what we have. And eventually you got to wait for that one gig where it, it all sort of makes sense and then it's, it's justified. Um, unfortunately, the opportunities for those are further and further between. Um, but, uh, you know, we're, we're striving for the top and, uh, I'm not going to stop till we get there. Yeah. Uh, I love that attitude, dude. Uh, it's amazing. And, and it's actually, it's, 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 it's one that, uh, people should learn that it's okay to be, to be confident. Don't be cocky about it. You've worked, you're not just saying this one day coming out in your, out of your first acting lesson. No, no. You've been doing this, like you said, for 20 years. Yeah. So uh, what are some of the things uh, for our listeners that they'll be like, okay, Sean Roberts sounds familiar. He's got a very distinct voice. I kind of got a Christian Slater feel to you. Uh, uh, what, I'm sure, have you heard that before? Yeah, that's, that's great. Uh, okay. Thanks. Um, no problem. And, and so what, what would people go, yeah, I, I know him. I get that all the time. And that's it, actually funny enough. It's only when I come back home uh, to Toronto that I get 
did we, how do I, did we go to school together? Huh. Um, how do I know you from something? And it's not, you know, any one particular gig, which I'm grateful for. I don't get hassled on the street after coming out of the club in the middle of the night or anything like that, which is great. I'm sure the um, chicks do, but that's a whole other story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, so oh, it's, you don't know uh, now? Now all of a sudden he's not cocky. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah. Um, but, yeah. Uh, just uh, I, yeah, just with the uh, I I do I do I do is that is that sort of the most recent thing that people would have seen you? In? Um, yeah, I mean if uh, if our viewers are watching Hallmark, then they definitely saw me um, at uh, Valentine's Day when that came out. That's right, of course. Um, sorry, yeah, yeah. So you know, and and we're trying to sort of get the whole span of uh, different genres in. So now we're into romantic comedies and 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 being that romantic lead. Uh, it's something different, and it's fun. You know, I mean, something for everyone. How was the Tomorrow People, and how was that filming in Edmonton? Uh, Tomorrow People was amazing because uh, that's one of my good friends, Robbie Amell, who it was his show, and um, I know that he had been sort of putting it in their ear that we should have Sean Roberts somewhere in you know in the mix, and then I got to be a part of the season finale or the series finale, and uh, it was great. And we shot in Vancouver, and I, I got to have my my stunt double in there, and it was it was fun. I had guns, and you know what did your stunt double do? Uh, constantly smashed his head off the concrete because um, they they do the whole um, airburst power thing and uh, yeah so he would go down to the ground to a point where it was you know I'm 40 feet away watching it from the sidelines just judging his falls and uh, I can hear the clunk of his skull constantly hitting the thing oh. and he's a badass he's like that's no big deal I'm like you are bleeding stop it hey what's up I'm Roddy Subscribe to our channel. You're going to love it. For the rest of this episode, you got to check out our podcast yeah. online on the website. Go check it out. You won't be disappointed.